Okay, so today I'm going to talk about this globe I've had for almost 10 years now that came out probably the 1880s, 90s. Uh, a gold medal, globe gold medal. It, it's, it came before the globe special. There's no dating of this, but I know that John J. Kimmel was playing the same exact accordion back in the 1800s the late 1800s, early 1900s, so let's get on with this. Okay, so I've had this for about 10 years. Uh, I've changed out some reeds. Some of the original reeds didn't want to tune, so I found some Czechoslovakian re reproduction reeds, and you can't tell the difference. I mean, th these are all Czechoslovakian reproduction reeds, right? Now here's all glow breeds. You can tell they're both parallel reeds and they work out really good. And so I, when I first got this, I needed a new keyboard. I thought the original keyboard would work, but most of the leaks you get out of an accordion are from the flappers and they the the valves the flapper valves and so i had my friend elton Doucet build a new keyboard for this the uh, base box is original and this this is because the vinyl is splitting and i just cut it off i didn't care i just cut it off it's comfortable <laughs> And um, I put brass bass buttons on it from Louisiana, I think. Somebody in Louisiana makes them. And they're very, very good. And uh, yeah, I, I've done a lot of things to get rid of every single leak possible because when you've got an accordion this old with parallel reeds, it's going to be a pain in the butt to play. It still is. I got rid of all internal leaks, all external leaks, and also I made these brass base buttons out of screw caps and screws and JB Weld, and they they're fucking awesome. And I can reach them better because th this base box has a wider range. So it's easier than the small buttons. And that's about it. This is my son. My, uh, the only son I'll ever have. <laughs> we did some paint job on it. Yeah, really bad. Not not too. Yeah, I'm mean, like that. Th this this is from tuning it. Just putting my hand on it, uh, holding it together, tuning it. I got rid of a lot of paint, but I don't care. Uh, that's a rid. Th this part is original. The the outer exterior frame is original. The reeds inside, most of them are original with the original reed blocks. And I remade the reed blocks on the base side to put the Dix Czechoslovakian reeds in it. But I also put, for the big reed, I put a benchy reed. Because it, it works a lot better than the reproduction of big reed. 